Gotta get there. <laughs> gotta get there. Gotta get there. Gotta get there. Ding, 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 ding! Top of morning! Irish noises! Welcome back, everybody, to Minecraft, the only game that matters anymore. Can you believe that Minecraft invented video games? Oh, we've got some big plans here today. We've got a lot of building to do. We've got a lot of Ireland to finish off. We have to get some ice for my polar bear. People keep telling me he's gonna despawn if I don't get ice for him. And I'm very, very nervous about it. I wanted to get him ice anyway. I wanted to build a polar palace, but I need silk touch to do it. And luckily, I have a silk touch enchantment book. I can actually enchant one of my pickaxes right now for silk touch, I think. If I put you in. Yeah, so you get Silk Touch, but I need level 30 to get it. And I kind of want to keep my Diamond Pickaxe for a better... Uh... For a better upgrade. So, I have a... Silk Touch. I kind of want to just try this out anyway. I don't know what I'm doing. I, I, I made another Diamond Pickaxe. I went mining before. In my... Underneath my pint of Guinness. And I got six more diamonds here. And I have three now in a new pickaxe. So what I'm gonna do is get to level 30. And I'm going to... Enchant this one. We'll enchant my second diamond pickaxe. Then we'll combine it with this. Hopefully we get like efficiency four? Or something? Or looting three? Or fortune three? Something like that. Something good. And then we combine them both. We get unbreaking three. And... Whatever this one ends up getting. And it's gonna be epic. I have an iron sword with sweeping edge too. Yeah, okay. Let's just go. Let's actually do this one. Meow! Hi! Oh god, what are you doing? Get off the saw blade! You're gonna cut your ass in half! Okay, well, if you're happy there, then I'm not gonna judge you. Uh, we're making stones here because I need to finish my stable as well. Lots to do. Lots to do in Minecraft. What was I doing right now? Enchanting. Got it. <laughs> too many things to do. My brain don't know how. Uh, put you in here. Oh, wait, I don't need this. I want to do it in the anvil. Whee! Wow! Oh, kitty. Oh. Uh, put you in. Can I put you in as well? Yes! A silk touch iron pickaxe. Uh, let's call him... Silky. <laughs> Got it. Nailed it. I put the wrong one in! How did I make that mistake? <laughs> this silk touch is going to run out immediately. Oh, it's almost nighttime as well. I'm not going out at nighttime. Turn the boat around. Go back to the shores of Ireland. God damn it all! Should have just whatever. What's done is done. You can't cry over spilt milk. <laughs> I can and I will. Go to sleep already. Ah, morning. Oh, get a good sip of those dirty beans. All right. The only reason I wanted Silk Touch was to go grab ice. We're heading off on an adventure. All of my own some. Stay quiet there, cows. Okay. Bye, windmill. Bye, crappy stable full of fin bars. I want to fix that stable this time. I promise you, fin bar. I'll come back. I'm a man of my word. Can I repair my enchanted iron pickaxe? Does it remove the enchantment if I repair it? That's kind of what I'm afraid of. I don't know. Maybe I can enchant the other one and then just combine them and have a really nice one. Question mark? I don't know. I need to make an ice palace for my polar bear. Something that Elsa would be proud of. Something big. Something extravagant. A snow field. An ice plane. Please tell me this silk pickaxe actually works in this. Not only does it work, it works so well! Don't you worry, Porig. I can't bring you back to the ice, but the ice can sure come to you. Wait, if I build out of this, is it gonna melt? Ah, uh, hi! <laughs> what are you doing out here? Oh, I packed ice. I can buy some from you if I had my emeralds on me, but I don't. Damn it, I need to bring back my pickaxe as well. as It's about to break. Hi. Oh, you have two of these guys now! I kind of want them. Huh? You guys want to go in a boat? Can can I? Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> no! Huh? Damn it! Okay, one of these. Oh, you went off your leash. Yes. Huh? Can, I, can I get in as well? 
Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! No! Okay, I have a solution. I have a solution. Here you go. Here you go. Nice! Yes! Come on, folks! You're coming back to Ireland! <laughs> it's not kidnapping! You, I put down the boat, you walked into it. It's your fault. If I put down this boat in front of you and you keep walking into it, that's your problem. Look at these guys go. Oh, shut up. Don't fight it. It's happening. See that pint in the distance? Wait for the- there's the flag! Oh, the green, white, and orange, the beautiful colors of Ireland, the tricolor, the colors of hope and freedom. You would never understand, but you're about to, because you're going to become part of Ireland now. All right, everybody out. We're at the shore. No, you're mine now. No, stop trying to go back to your master. I am your master now. You belong to me. Come in here. There you go. Now, hop on in here. Good job. This is your home now. You're not allowed to go anywhere else. Ah! Oh! What is happening? What is happening? Does he still count as attached to the other one? Why are you freaking out? Wait, is that three emeralds for one piece of ice? How dare you, sir? How dare you? I shake my fist at you. How dare you try and sell me at such steep prices? Also, I changed their graves a little bit to make them more spectacular. Here lies Searsha, dog mom. And here lies unnamed dog pup. They never got a name, they're never gonna get a name. I don't know what the name would have been. I do have names in mind next time. All right, folks, it's happening. I have to ration my ice, because I don't know how much I actually have and how much of a base I can build. But I'm hoping it's gonna be something worthy of a polar bear. It's gonna be like you're at home again, dude. No! Don't break my pickaxe! Okay. No! Ah! Easy does it there, Jack. Place one by one. Nice, yes. Okay, we can build it a little bigger. It's also gonna double as like an ice rink. For people who wanna dance. Where did they go? Whatever. So during Christmas time, we'll open this up to kids and families. So we can earn a little extra money on the side. You think Ireland runs on free? You think Ireland runs on wind and potatoes? Real Ireland does. In-game Minecraft Ireland does not. Oh, beautiful. I have one left over. <laughs> nice. Uh, or should I say, ice. <laughs> Okay, it's time to put a, a little fence rooney around this. Okay, Porig, are you still alive? You're still alive in there. I was like, is that a polar bear or just a giant sheep? That's what the cows think it is. Ooh, I could just put both in and then I get this back. Sweet! Oh, nice! Can I just do that forever? I didn't lose it. Hooray! I was really worried about that. <laughs> Oh, bless the gods. So Silk Touch doesn't let you actually grab, like, monster spawners and stuff. I don't know why I thought that you could actually grab a monster spawner. But it does let you grab item blocks that would normally shatter. I mean, you figure that out by now, because I just did it. Do I really need a double fence here? Yes. Need to separate you. Because a polar bear does not eat sheep. But we've never seen a super hungry polar bear yet, either, so... Who knows? Maybe they would. Alright, Parik! Time to go! Did I- did I get him? Okay, say goodbye to your friends! Now take a wide angle past that fire. Don't- no, don't go near it. Probably shouldn't have fire near the ice palace. Come on in! There you go! Oh, yo, you came in with speed and... Uh-oh. Good job, Parik! You made it! You made it back home! Is it everything you thought it was? Is it just like you remembered? Right? I know. And then we put one like... There. There. Have fun. Play with that. Ah, God! Ow! I just told him not to walk over it. Oh, what's up, Pigman? He came out. He, he heard that there was a new attraction. He heard that somebody opened up uh, a polar play place. And he wanted to come out and see. It's not open yet. It's only open for polar bears right now. You're gonna have to come back during Christmas for the... For the ice skating season. Okay, let's put a sign on it. 
Polar. Uh, play. No, I messed it up. Okay, well that sign is stupid. But, you know what, it's our sign, and it's here now. Polar play place. Have fun, Porig. Just kick up some snow. Sorry, it doesn't actually snow here. But it also doesn't have fish. But, oh, he's gone now. Okay, come back later for the two-for-one special. Bringing Mrs. Pigman. Al's back, everybody! Al never left! This is the same Al. See, we technically didn't see Al die, so... Until something dies, it's just gone. Just like Seamus. Seamus didn't actually die. He just left. The door opened and Seamus was like, ha yeet! And just, he, he gone. He jumped off the top and swam back, so... At some point, I'll find Seamus again. But Al, welcome back. I'm gonna make this place look nicer, Al. I know, last time you left, it didn't look great. It still doesn't look great, but I have the means to fix it. That looks better. That looks much better. It's still not perfect, it's still not exactly the way I would like it to be, but at least it looks less... derpy. Hey! Get out of that farm! Frickin', you can't come into an Irish farm and expect to be able to farm like an Irishman. That's not how it works. You need years of practice, years of training, and years of your dad hitting you with your belt. <laughs> That's a bad joke. Um, do you have any slabs? Ooh, slabs would actually work better. Nothing can spawn in here, right, if I put slabs on it. That's not tall enough to spawn anything. Because that's really what it's all about. Although, let's face it, most buildings have monsters in their ceilings. When you're a kid, and you hear those creepy noises, especially when I was a kid, I used to hear creepy noises in our house all the frickin' time, it used to scare me. You know that there's just monsters up in the attic. Parents are like, oh, monsters aren't real. Yeah, they are. And they live in the attic. No! Chimney stack! Ah. EXP, please. Thank you. Ow, 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 ow! <laughs> the entire ocean is right there! I'm on fire! What do I do? Ow, ow, ow! <laughs> oh, brain, come on! Can you work for once? Just once! In this life of ours. We're stuck in this for a while, man. Just work once! Doesn't even have to be anything spectacular. Like, you don't need to, like, cure cancer or make a scientific discovery. Just figuring out how to be mindful in Minecraft would be nice. See if this works. Silk touch, pickaxe, on a fire. Haha! -ha! Hey, look, I did it! <laughs> Perfect! It's got its own little smokestack! Okay, you just. You just gotta not look at it from any other angles. You have to look at it from this angle and this angle only. Because as soon as you go to another angle, um... It stops working. Oh, I have an even better idea! Oh, I'm so smart. Could I? Oh, could I, could I? Uh, I probably could, but I should make an exit first. Yes! Maybe if I left it, it would actually just burn the whole place down. <laughs> you know what? That's good enough for me. For now, at least. Until, unless somebody else has a better solution, because from one angle it looks like there's smoke coming out of it, and then another angle it's like, yeah, whatever. Kind of looks like it. It's fine. As long as this doesn't burn the whole stable down, I'll be happy. Okay. That does this for now. It got a little bit better. A little bit better than it was before. And you know what? A little bit better is better than not better at all. Then you can- you can take that to the bank! What the- Hey! Can you stop throwing tritons at me? Unless you're gonna give me one! Where are you getting all these? Good god! He's got a million of them! Stop it, Poseidon! Okay, I gotta eat. Oh god. Oh god. Get out! Get out! Get out! Shapers! Oh god, oh god, oh god. It's all over! Okay, eat first. Eat first, kill later. I want one of those tritons! I don't actually know if you can get them, but 
if you can, your boy's gonna have one, and I'm gonna throw it. I'm gonna throw it right back at him. Okay, no trident. <laughs> can I just take this one? Did they fall? See, this works like a charm, everybody. Oh damn it! Oh damn it! Oh damn it! They're all in there with Porig. Oh no! <laughs> okay, well, I think it's. Oh. What? Why did you explode? Oh, for the love of God! Good, I need to go get ice again. Ah! Oh God, another creeper. Okay, Porik, stay there. Stay there and don't drift too far. Oh, making my life a living heck, a living nether. I shake my fist at thee. Oh my God, creepers suck. Yes, I know my cat can keep the creepers away, but the last time I brought my cat outside, it, I almost lost it. I'm worried about my cat. Take that iceberg. You won't sink the Titanic again. This is revenge for you, Titanic. The Titanic was built in Ireland. In Northern Ireland. It was built in Belfast. So I'm, I'm taking revenge for what you did to the, to the beautiful ship. This all happened because I didn't place enough torches around my base. That's, that's what you get. That's what you get when you don't use your brain. They didn't explode because of him, did they? Oh god, where's all the pieces of my fence gone? Oh, they just exploded! God, reduced to atoms! If that creeper has a manager, I am so calling it. There you are, Parik. Safe again. Let me take you off this. There you go. Go! Have fun! Jump around! Play a little! Do whatever polar bears do. I don't know. What what do you do for fun? What do you do on the weekends? Don't look at me. I don't know what to do. Don't turn your back to me. Okay, I don't want to see your tail. Your tailpipe. How you guys doing? What? Are you kidding me? Al escaped again! Albert! Where did you go? That slippery snake! Every time I turn my back, he's gone. You know what? One of these days, I'm gonna have name tags for all of you, and then it's over for your escaping days. Once you get the name tag, it's basically a prison sentence. A lovely prison sentence. A prison sentence full of hope and wonder. Finbar, I don't know why everybody leaves. I'm a good owner, right? I- I like to think so. I treat you guys nicely. I give you your own hay bale. And your own room, even though some people said you weren't old enough for it. But I said, you know what? No, Finbar is definitely a horse that knows what he's doing. And everyone still leaves. Sad. I'm heading out to do a spot of fishing. I've never fished in this game. People said I can get name tags that way. I don't know how true that is. How, how do I how do I fish? I don't know what I'm doing. Come on, fish. Take the bait. Is, is it working? Am I fishing? Is this fishing? Oh, wait. Something happened that time. Oh. Huh. Nice. Good cast. I saw extra bubbles that time. What do I do when that happens? I got something. Fishy business. What did I get? Uh, salmon. Cool. All I have is lure 2 on this thing. I don't have anything else. Maybe I should... I don't know what else you can get on an enchanted fishing rod. I had an enchanted fishing rod before I had enchanted most other things. Come on, fish. Come on, here we go. Here we go. Catch a big one. Catch Poseidon himself. Catch a... Come on. I got one! Yeah! Name tag! That's what I want to get. I don't know how a name tag got caught in my fishing line. Oh, nighttime fishing. Yeah, that's when you get the best ones. Come on. Here we go. Here we go. Ah, I caught a fish. Who would have thought that you'd catch fish while fishing? That's silly. Oh god, creeper. Wait, hold on. I want to test something. I had an enchanted book before, right? Uh, there's leather and paper to make a book, right? 
Can I make enchanted books? Oh my god, I can! Oh, that's so much easier! Piercing 2, projectile protection. Oh, I could just get efficiency 4 here with the book and then combine the book with the diamond pickaxe. Ooh, I still need to be level 30 for that though. Come on. I got to level 26 or something when I was building more of my, my windmill. I was adding little bits around the sails off camera and I fell off and died and lost all my levels. I was so close to level 30. Got one name tag at least though. That's a good sign. Here you go. Boop. Hey, there you go. You're Porig. That's how you pronounce it. You could also say Podrig. Podrig, if you wanted to. It's Irish for Patrick. And he's the patron saint of Ireland. All right, he's a whole day dedicated to him. So you're a very special bear, Porig. Good boy. Nice. I just need one for Finbar. And I need to find Seamus again. If I had a name tag for Seamus all that time, disaster never would have struck. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I forgot. I got nether wart last time. Let me take half of this. Because I think that I can plant some of this here in soul sand. It was growing in soul sand before. So if I just plant some soul sand myself and put nether wart in it, I should be able to grow my own nether wart? Maybe over by the graves. Yeah, really make it look like a graveyard. Put it out behind. Wait, does, does it need like water? No, there's no water in the nether. Aww. I know it's nether wart. And it's technically like something from the hell dimension. Heck, sorry. Um, but this is kind of nice. <laughs> it looks like there's flowers next to the grave. I should just go get flowers. Some really nice flowers from that biome that I was at, up that way. Oh yeah, and bring them back and then plant them all around the... That'd be nice, that'd be a nice trip. Alright, I have another venture. I have so many ventures that I'm doing. I have so many things that I'm building. And the next on my chopping block is a pub. I'm gonna build a pub in Minecraft. Underneath my pint of Guinness. I feel like that that's a really great place to have a pub. What else should I be making? Uh... Maybe spruce trapdoors? Let's build a little more of them. Because they're going to be our tables. But I also need some more fence posts. Did I put some, some of them in? Okay, good. Uh, and I have some of my barrels. Can I, can I make barrels? I can. Ooh. Let's do that. I have seven barrels. Sweet. Tasty jams. Alright, down we go. Uh, down we go. I would go down through the pint, but I actually have no way of getting onto the pint. So it's not so much an elevator as it is an exit from underneath the ground. Down we go! This is also still kind of fun. Nice. So I went digging all the way down through here. This is where I found more of my diamonds. But I hollowed out all of this area. So this is going to be our, our bar. Um, I didn't bring any rock. <laughs> really? Woo! Need to be careful in this area though, because right behind this, all of that cobblestone where I filled in is <laughs> is water. So this is a very scary place to be building a pub in, because if anything goes wrong in here, the whole place floods. But that's what we want. Prohibition is in. I'm gonna make my own little speakeasy that you need to get down into. Ah, lovely already. A nice wooden floor. Grand looking. Lovely bites, lovely job. Um, I am going to need to replace most of the walls. Wait, does this does this look like normal stone? If I just put in my stone, yes, 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 yes. Also, I did not know this until yesterday that if I put down this, I can right click with an axe to to debark it. I had. No idea. I went looking for all of those like really smooth blocks that the people in the villages had Without realizing that I had those blocks all along. It was just any basic tree <laughs> I feel so dumb that my friends is how you turn a Crappy area into a solid block 
All right, what is our what is our bar actually going to look like? Polished andesite. What does that look like? It's okay. It's not great though. What happens if I put slabs on top of it? Oh, now the bar is a bit too high though, isn't it? What are you gonna be a shorty? It's too high for a person. Oh god, I'm inside your head. <laughs> what are you thinking? There, not bad, not bad. Very epic. Okay, now I can put back in these bad boys. Put in some put a table there and a table there. Yes. Oh wait, no. I should put them. Dang, how do I make something look like a chair? Steps don't work, do they? No. Think, 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 think. Oh my god. I made chair. I make chair now. Look, tiny chairs. Super cute. Wow. Okay, which ones are gonna have chairs around them? These ones? Probably. Thanks for answering, guys. Yo, answer back if you're a gamer. Oh my god, those are so cute. Those are so cute! <gasps> yes! You just put down stairs, and then put down little signs on the sides of them that makes chairs! Chair stairs, it makes sense! I could bring them out from the wall and actually... Wait, hold on. What about if this one is an extendo? Yes! <laughs> oh, and I have all my casks over here, so these are like vintage 19... 40s whiskey. Uh, these are some just some old school like kegs. You know, come on in. You want to get a beer? You just do. Yeah, you get there. Just imagine there's like dish rags and there's bottles lying around and you know stuff like that. I don't have those because I can't. Oh, maybe we should make some. No, I was gonna say maybe we could make some windows down here, but no, it needs to be dingy. I'm also trying to see how much I can get away with lighting. Um. Because ideally, I would like to only light, like, here? Does that count as a monster being able to get in there? I would really hope not, because I like the sort of, like, dingy lighting of the area. Oh, definitely something's gonna spawn in there. The least amount of lighting possible. Because it makes it dark, it makes it quiet, it makes it somber. Maybe I should make some more lanterns. Well, I guess I'll find out if I come back down here and there's monsters. <laughs> Whee! It is time for some of the finishing touches. No! Does it look like I wanted a door there? Oh, boom. What do you could make like a stone door so it blended into the wall and you had to come up and be like, Knock, knock! Knock, knock! It's me! And then we're gonna put a sign here that says Sean's... Uh, bar. Nope, down another one. Bar. That looks lame, man. Can I- can you do different fonts or something? Oh, man. This place is really starting to come together. Come to nether? Ha <laughs> ha! There we go. A dark oak sign to go with the door. Nice, and I made two more dark oak doors for here. So... Everything here is self-contained. Everything here looks nice. If you want to actually go down into the mine even further, which I still need to build my back cave with all my cool accessories, you can go down there. Oh, that doesn't look nice. Dang it. Do I have... Ooh, silk touch pickaxe. Will you actually just make stone? Yes. Sweet. Eh, voila. Beautiful. Très magnifique, beautiful. Uh, what did I want to put in here? I brought something with me. Oh, lanterns. Yeah. Let's put... No. Can I not... Oh. That works. How bright are you, though? Pretty dang bright. The whole... That one thing can light up almost the entire area. No. I can put stuff in the barrels? I thought they were just for show! <laughs> uh, no, and let's not use Silky for you, because I don't need to. Yeah, you're gonna spawn something if I don't put anything there. Nice! Oh, man! Ah! 
Beautiful! Wait, can I hang it from the ceiling? No. No, I cannot. So come on down to Sean's bar, where drinks are on me all the time. All I ask is that you wash your shoes before you come in, you take the flu network, you take the ele the, the Guinness elevator, the alcohol elevator, and you cleanse your soul before you come in for a night of debauchery and a night full of fun and partying. Bring your pets if you want to. We're very pet friendly down here. And the reason I named it Sean's Bar is not only because my name is Sean, but there's a bar in Ireland named Sean's Bar, which is the oldest pub in Europe and potentially existence. It's from the year 900 AD. I've talked about this before and I talked about it in my live show and it's a very important place. So come on down to Sean's Bar. It's removed and relocated. It's now in Minecraft. Guys, I've been living in dirty squalor all this time. Been sleeping in one tiny, tiny bed. When I could have been living like a king. In my big, deluxe, double bed. King size, queen size bed. Alright Sam, let's go. We have an adventure that we are going to do today together. Not you. You're gonna stay here and man the fort, okay? Can you do that? Are you good enough for that? Are you strong enough? I think you are. I think you're plenty strong. Alright, you can come upstairs though if you want. I kind of don't like you sitting on that saw blade. Come on. Do you want to sit in the bed? Come on. Come on. Why is this so hard for you? Come on. Okay, just sit there instead. All right, Sam. You and I are heading out together. I need you specifically because I, uh, I kind of did a bad last time. <laughs> a little bit ago. Uh, I don't know if you guys remembered, but, um, Sam had a girlfriend and a and a son and they they didn't make it. What's that Sam? No, what are you talking about? I know that you move without needing a, a leash and I trust you and everything, but sometimes you're a little slow at doing what I need you to do. Into the boat. Hop on in, there you go. It's almost like you don't want to go on an adventure. It's almost like you don't trust me anymore. Which I don't know why you wouldn't, Sam. I'm a delightful human being. <laughs> I'm your dad. Oh god, I left a big gap up there. Shh! <laughs> don't look at it! This is where I found them, Sam. This is where Saoirse was. She was just hanging out, a lonely dog all on her own. And I gave her purpose. For, for a little bit, anyway. It didn't last very long. <laughs> Ocean man, take me by the hand, lead me to the Sam that you understand. Ocean Sam, voyage to the corner of the globe is a real trip, trip, trip. You having, you having fun, Sam? I am. This is great. Take your tongue out. It's fun. Let the wind blow by your ears, Sam. It's a lovely time to be alive. Oh god, oh, it's too soon. Oh, <laughs> look, octopus. Squids, fish. What's that sound? What are you? Hello? Puffer fish. Whoa. Ah. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh, the sea is a nightmare. Oh wait, now I'm just drowning. <laughs> Okay, time you didn't see anything. I'm an expert survivalist, an expert explorer. Here we are, Sam. Up ahead, it's the flower biome. It's a lovely place. Sam, we're here to pick out some flowers for Saoirse and unnamed pups graves. And I figured that you would be the best person to help out in this regard. Because they, they were your family. I was in their lives for a short period of time. I wish this boat was in our lives right now, Sam. I wish you were in my life right now, Sam. Okay. Well, it looks good, Sam. You pick out some flowers. Have a little look around and pick out some flowers that you think would be good. I trust your judgment. It's all up to you. You want the orange? Okay, good choice. Very good choice. You like the orange a lot, I see. And the white flowers? Sam, are you doing what I think you're doing? I think I know what Sam's trying to do. Sam's trying to make the Irish flag. For the ones we have lost. That's so sweet, Sam. They'd like that. They'd love that. For you are green. You're the green flower. 
The flower that lived on. The flower that will pass us all. And they will be the white and orange. Good choice, Sam. We plant orange flowers. For Searsha. And we plant white flowers. For unnamed puppy dog. Together. They will live on in our hearts. They are gone. But never forgotten. I kinda wanna redo the front of my castle as well. I wanted to have like an archway that comes out to like here and then the drawbridge comes out to here. So, I'll be getting rid of all of this. Don't worry! It won't be gone for long! We're gonna make it cool and epic at the same time. Excuse me! Could you not drown in front of my glory greatest country? I know you're wearing gold armor. And it's nice and it goes with like the whole aesthetic of Ireland. In a way, you know, we're, we're bright shiny glorious beings. But, you being on my property is not that nice. Sorry, I'm, I, I get very defensive when it comes to Ireland. Um, I'm trying to make... Oh, perfect. It's actually the exact size. I'm trying to make like one of these little towers here at the very front. So, I want to break up the shape of the castle a bit more. It's a bit too boring. Yes, just like that. Okay, I'm afraid to go a little further. I do need EXP though. So maybe we should just go fight some stuff. Let's go fight some creepers. Huh? What do you think about that, huh? What's up, creeps? Oh god, why did you have to be here? Why did you guys have to hit me? That was my creeper! That was my experience points! Oh, he has a hole in the ground. Ooh! Whoa! Are you a poison villager? Villager zombie! Even though I don't know what the rest of you guys would be. Okay, let's fill up this hole. Let's go fight creepers! That's a good idea! And the glorious piece that's gonna top all of this off is a nice little archway that we are going to build, isn't it? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Now, how does this archway going to actually look? Is a completely different question. Um... Maybe go a little bit higher with it? Bring blocks in... What am I trying to do? I don't even know at this point. What am I trying to do? Not that! No, I need blocks- okay, yeah. <sighs> My brain, why? It's not great, because everything kind of just blends together. Like when you're looking at it straight on, it doesn't really look like what I want it to look like. It's better than what it was. It's a little more full. I also like this. The pillars holding it up. And there you have it, folks. The new drawbridge is in place. That looks nicer. I like the, the small stack and the big stack next to each other. It really makes the castle actually look a lot more irregular shaped. Yeah. Oh, I need to take away all this. People were showing me a way of using chickens for the drawbridge. Like putting chickens in blocks behind here and attaching leashes on them and then putting the leashes on these. So that the leashes just stay there. But that would mean putting some poor little chickens in there. And first of all, I don't know how to do that. How would I get a chicken in there? Can I put chickens on leashes? Um, where would I even put a chicken? Like there? Wouldn't they die? Put a chicken in there and then block it off. And then another one in there. Would that work? Are they in line? Yeah. Okay, let me go see if I can get a chicken. Two chickens. How- how would I even get them in there? How would I get them up there? You can't pick up a chicken. Hmm. This might prove very tricky. Come along, chicken! <laughs> I was gonna say, wait, can I even put, uh, leashes on chickens? But the whole point of getting the chicken is so I could put a leash on him. Okay, come along. There we go, I have two chickens. <laughs> oh, you're so cute! I really should make... A chicken farm, if I want to do this. Because I am going to need feathers. No, where'd you go? Come along. 
The more important part is that I don't lose my leashes when you do that. Leashes are hard to come by. Unless a trader comes by and I kill his alpacas again. Can you guys come across the water? Oh yes, you can. <laughs> Why does this work every time? Why does every animal do this? This feels like nothing but pure punishment at this point. But it's funny, so what are you gonna do? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, someone's throwing tridents at me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, God. This is the worst! Come here. Oh, God. Oh, God. How did that hit me? Come on, I was blocking. Oh, Jesus. No! Oh, come on! Sweet Jesus! The monster's nearby. Yeah, no dip. At least my chickens are still here, but... I lost all my dang levels again. I'm waiting so long just to enchant some stuff. Oh, whatever. Oh my god, yes. Oh my god, yes, come in. No, 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 no. Yes. Yes. No, 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 go back down, go back down, please. Oh. Come on, you, come down. Yeah. Okay, now all I have to do is... Uh, nope. Now all I have to do is attach the leash down here? It's not working. It's not working, I can't. <laughs> it's too long! I don't know what's happening! It's broken! Oh my god, I did it for one! I did it! Look! Yeah! Oh, that looks weird though. <laughs> And oh, now I have chickens cooking in my walls all the time. Wait, is that other lead still here? Okay, I don't need your eggs. Um, how do I get out of this again? <laughs> this is proving quite tricky to do. Uh, drop down and there. <laughs> oh man, I can't get it to go further though. I'd need the chickens another block over. Oh, that doesn't look right. I get the idea behind it, and it would be neat if it actually worked, but this doesn't look like it's working. I can't put it out the next pole. It doesn't connect. It seems like it's too far away. Dang it. That would have been super fun. Doesn't look good though. And I'm wasting leads, so I'm sorry chickens. But you have to pay the ultimate price. Maybe there's a better way of doing it in the future. Maybe I'm actually missing a component of how to how to actually do it. But that didn't seem like it would work. At least not in survival mode. Maybe in maybe there's a different way of doing it in creative that would work a lot better. Let me put some stuff up here just in case people decide, "Hey, I want to spawn up here today." And I'd be like, oh, no, no. Alright, Sam, another day draws to a close. We stole some chickens, we built some stuff, we made the polar play place, and we built a pub all the way down. Now, if you don't mind, Sam, I'm going to go down and have a few pints, because I've had a long, stressful day. <laughs>